anticipated Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft has landed in Srihrikota and will soon be integrated with India's most powerful rocket, GSLV MK3 or LVM3, for the country's third mission to the moon in July. Chandrayaan-3 consists of an indigenous lander module, propulsion module, and a rover with an objective of developing and demonstrating new technologies required for interplanetary missions, ISRO said. ISRO Chairman S. Somanath said, ISRO is planning to launch the Chandrayaan-3 mission in July. The window for the mission launch will be from 12th July onwards. Before its arrival in Sriharikota, Chandrayaan-3 had successfully passed several key tests, demonstrating its capacity to survive the challenging acoustic environment that the spacecraft would have to deal with during its lunar launch. Somnath had said while the mission parameters would remain the same, the design and engineering are significantly different. Compared to Chandrayaan 2 to make it more robust and avoid the problems from last time. Chandrayaan 3 will lift off from Satish Dhawan Space Center in July to go into an elliptical orbit around the moon before attempting to soft land on the south pole side of the moon. The objectives of the Chandrayaan 3 mission which will be for a duration of 14 Earth days, are to demonstrate safe and soft landing on the lunar surface, rover walking on the moon and to conduct in situ scientific experiments. The lander and the rover are loaded with scientific payloads to carry out several experiments on the lunar surface. Chandrayaan-1 was launched on 22 October 2008 by the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle. Chandrayaan-2 was launched on 22 July 2019 